My oil's leaking, did you know that? From right here? Oil pan, how oily it is. It's dripping from it. And it's not dripping from the oil filter, it's dripping from like the oil pan. It's, it's everywhere. I'm scared. We're good. We're good. We're good. Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. So as you can already tell, we are doing an oil change on the ZL1 today and I have already done a video in the past on how to do a ZL1 or how to do a ZL1. I have already done a video in the past on how to do an oil change on a Camaro ZL1. So for this video, it's gonna be a little more um, freestyle vlog type video rather than a how-to. So if you guys do wanna see a how-to on do, how, so I cannot talk today. If you guys do wanna see a how-to on how to change your oil, then go watch that video. Um, but for now, today is just gonna be a little more of a chill day recording changing my oil. So I guess let's do it. And I've already started as you can see, um, but yeah. And I don't know if I said this on my last video, but I have noticed that my oil is leaking from somewhere because my oil is literally all over um, the oil pan. As you guys can see, I'll show you, my oil pan is filthy. We kind, I kind of already wiped it off, but um, it's like dripping from like right here and it'll just like drip onto the floor. So no bueno. Oh, Jesus. the first time I ever did an oil change or like learned how to do one for my dad. Um, he just told me not to take the oil filter off all the way and just let it drip like that and then take it off. And that's just what I've done ever since. So here we are. And then it's kind of less of a mess if you do it that way. I feel like it's very oily though. Very. Very oily. Well, um, cleaned off the oil on the oil pan. Uh, so now it looks all pretty and the oil filter is on. So now it's time to lower the car and put the oil in the car. So, all right guys, <laughs> I know this looks really sketchy. Our shop bathroom literally looks like it can be on the movie Saw. And it just, it's not that pretty, but you know, this is what I got to work with. And I just wanted to tell you guys, if you have ever used like these kinds of soaps, like the soaps with like the graininess to them, it's literally like the best thing ever. So I'm gonna wash my hands in this beautiful, not so glamorous, but yeah, this is like the best soap ever. More. Ugh.
What the f- I don't know if the car is gonna start with the hood open, remote started, but I guess we'll find out in a second. No. Let's close the hood and see if that helps. There we go. In the color purple. <laughs> waiting for some moy, moy. Why can I not talk today? I am waiting for some more oil for my car so I can finish up the oil change. Um, but in the meantime, I am filming that trend. I don't know if you guys have seen where it's like, I'm a car girl, of course. I'm gonna da 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 da. So I'm doing that and that was a little behind the scenes, so. All right, guys. So I am letting the car run for a little bit and as you saw, I like wiped off the oil pan. Um, so hopefully gonna let it run and see if we can see where it's leaking from exactly But I feel like it's like the oil like pan gasket or like the seal because it looks like a little wonky But we're gonna let it run and then raise the car back up and hopefully see where it's leaking guys I just want to show you how low my car is to the point where my headers are scraping this badly um, Yeah, so those are are what my headers are looking like. That's insanity. And then my car scrapes so badly that the V clamp is literally torn. So I think it's leaking from like where it's like sealed on the top in the back. Why do you say that? Because there's like a trail of oil. Like well, you want to let it run on the rack for a while? I just want to wait till next time we wrap I don't, it up. I don't care. You should clean up all this, look. But like, look how dirty it is at the top of the seal up there. In the middle. You have to look in the middle. It's like all dirty. Yeah, that's, a, that's where it's coming from. So it's from. the seal? It's all glue. You gotta take it down and glue it and put it back Silicone? on. Silicone? Yeah. I, I thought it was a gasket. They don't even have gaskets anymore. Oh, well. That's what's leaking. They use the white stuff. <laughs> It literally looks like my car is like falling off the lift. Guys, <laughs> guys, look at what my car looks like. I didn't realize what it looked like in the front. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it literally looks like it's hitting the floor. There's like this big of a gap down there right now. But this is what we had to do because we didn't have the low profile jack. And so we had to like jack it all the way up in the front just for the lift to fit because my car is so freaking low, but that looks insane. <laughs>